What's up guys, Tevin here back again with another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. So in the last video we arrived at the Dark City Trino, and as you guys saw at the end of the last video, I also found the last two Starlit Seals that I was looking for inside of Trino. So now that I have all those, I'm actually going to come up into this building, and I'm actually going to talk to this lady over here this time. If I can. I'm collecting star-shaped coins called Stella... Stella Zio. I'll just call it that, Stella Zio. Oh, you have the cancer. Give it to me in return for a reward. Will you give me the cancer? Yes, I will. Will you give me your cancer? Okay, sure. Oh, you are most kind. Now give it to me. Alright, so this is where we're going to be coming every time we get another one of the um, Zodiac sign coins here. Quack, quack, quack. You may take the reward from my servant. And we get 1,000 gil. And we have to keep doing this um, to give her all the ones we have, so we'll just hurry up and go through all this. So you have the Gemini, give it to me in return for a reward. Yep, here you go. And she just says the same thing over and, over and again. And we'll just slowly fill up this room, so I'll be making sure to do my best to get all these for you guys to show it off. Because there is something really special you can get when you get all of them. And the reward this time is a Phoenix Pinion. And I don't want to talk to you again, I want to talk to her. And this time she wants a Tauros. And um, in the last video, I also went to a place called Quan's Dwelling. Um, that's where we're going to need to go when we give her all 12 of these to get the last one. So that's what um, was so important about going to that place earlier, so you actually know where you need to go. Alright, so this time she's taking Ares. And so far, we haven't missed a single one that we come across that we were able to get. At first, I thought I missed one back in Limblum, but apparently, like... It's not there right now. Oh, that time it gave us a blood sword. And I feel like I'm only interested in collecting still. Okay, I don't have any more. Okay, yeah, that was all four. All right, cool. So now we got all those. Let's go ahead and back out. But first, I actually want to check out that blood sword and see if... Yes, it increases things by four, but I'm still in the process of learning the um, armor break move for this one. So I'll go ahead and stick with that for now and later on when I grind up. I'll eventually learn that and switch to that. So anyway, now that we got all that and we're situated, let's actually head back to where we need to go, which is going to be the auction house. So I'll cut back over there. And back at the auction house, now we can actually go inside this building. So progress for the story, meet up with Garnet, or Dagger, who's in here. Princess, thank goodness I found you. I was worried. How can I find the super soft when I keep having to listen to your complaints? Such harsh words. I don't think it's here anyway. Where's Marcus? I do not know. Maybe Marcus found it already. Are you coming? I'm going with or without you. I, I, I shall follow you, princess. Alright, and at this point we now take control of Dagger again. I've seen him before. She was referring to the man that we saw in the last part both with uh, Dagger and with Zidane earlier before we got knocked out. Anyway, now that we're back in control of Yarnet, was there anything I wanted to equip on her? I don't think there is. I think I fully got everything I needed for her anyway. Oh, you know what? No, that's not true. Because I did also get some new items too, so put this on so she can learn that. Um... This will increase her stats, but it doesn't let her learn anything, so I'm not that big on it for the moment. And Desert Boots, oh, Coral Rings, she learns Insomniac, Auto Potion, Coise. I want Ability Up. I want her to learn that as soon as possible. Alright, cool. So that should be good enough for her. And now we need to go up and catch up with Marcus, so let's head over to the other side of town. Where he was last seen, we were checking off with, um... The ATEs, he was inside this bar over here. Hurry up and go inside. Come down here. Here he is. We're ready to retrieve the Super Soft. Good, at last, we can save Blank. When do we leave? We can leave right away, so you're coming along, huh? Are you ready? Yep, I'm, I have nothing else left I need to do here, so I'm ready. Let's go. Princess! Please wait! Boss is waiting at the dock. Boss? You mean... Yep, 
there's only one man we call boss. Alright, so let's hurry up and get on with stealing the super soft. So we actually need to come down here. Princess, please wait! It may be a trap. You cannot trust criminals. Think of the consequences. You are a princess. Exactly. I'm a princess. There are no consequences. Ah, consequences. If the queen hears about this. Princess, do you know what breaking and entering is? Do you know that breaking and entering is a crime? I need to make sure you don't steal anything else. Let's go. Damn it. I am coming along. It is my duty to protect the princess from bad influence. You've been doing a terrible job, but that is the case. Do whatever you want. Always talking about your duty. Ain't you got any thoughts of your own? Don't you talk back to me. I am escorting the princess. I thought you might have changed after traveling with Zidane, but... You ain't changed. Do you even know why you're here? What, what do you mean? Let's just go, okay? Oh, there goes Hi Kuja again. How is Bermesia? Not bad. Better if I didn't have to see those vermin and the ugly elephant lady. They offend my senses. You must be tired. It's not over yet. The rest of the vermin must be done away with. Will you be headed to Clamor then? Yes, I trust you will deliver them. Certainly, I shall prepare now. By the way, did you see a pretty lady in the crowd today? A pretty lady? Shall I arrange a meeting? There is no need. The canary I've been after. She flew into my cage of her own free will. Hmm? Never would I have imagined running into you in a place like this. It must be fate. But you cannot rest your wings yet. Fly home to your mother, my little canary. I too will welcome you home with open arms. Pretty ominous words there, Kuja. Oh, yeah, this is a nice, pleasant stroll with our characters right now. What in the world am I doing? I'm assisting thieves in committing a crime. No. I must be patient. Protect the princess. Escort her back to the castle. Focus on your duties. Trust the queen. She would never commit an atrocity. There must be a good reason. No thoughts of my own. Nonsense. How can I, a lowly knight, understand the queen's thinking? I need not worry about the ramblings of a criminal. Just think about escorting the princess home. I'll probably never see him again. He was the culprit. He pulled the princess and me into all this... Ah, all into his intrigues. It was your fault, Zidane. If you hadn't treated me like a child, I wouldn't be here, hunting after Supersoft to save one of your friends. Why am I doing this? Because Blank saved me? Yes, he saved me. He saved my life. The least I can do is return the favor. But I never thought about things like this before. So it seems like Zidane is having somewhat of a, I won't say a negative, but a somewhat positive effect on both of these guys, making them think for themselves now. How do we find the super salt in this mountain of boxes? Just find it. Oh, this is a sense of the shot we were in before. Someone's coming. It's a little owl man. Oh, I can't believe I ran out of ink on a night like this. I must find more ink and go back to the observatory. Should I take care of him? Wait! Princess, no! Hmm? Y you're... I've missed you, Dr. Tot. But Princess! Princess Garnet! Dr. Tot? You know him? 
Dr. Todd is a highly respected scholar who tutored the princess. Ah, oh, Master Steiner, you must be quiet, or you'll wake the shopkeeper. But princess, what on earth are you doing here? It's a long story. We're looking for Supersoft right now. There is a proper reason for this. We are not here to steal or commit any form of crime. Somebody down there? Run along. I will give you your super soft later. Go left from Trino entrance and continue until you find a large tower. The tower is my home. It's locked, but I shall unlock the door and await your arrival. Alright, let's go back. Thank you, Dr. Tot. I'll see you later. Oh, it's you, Dr. Tot. Ah, great timing. I ran out of ink. You should have called me. I'll get yelled at if our inventory is wrong. Princess. Well, that was a good stroke of fate for us. So this Tootsie's going to give us Super Soft? It's Tot. Yeah, it's you! Whatever. I can't believe the Tantalus is at the mercy of some old man. Hmm. I guess we gotta keep babysitting the princess. Still? He ain't gonna give you the super soft unless you're with the princess. That's the deal, princess. I'm asking you to take Marcus to this toot. It's tot. I was going to anyway. Well, get some rest before you go. I'm sure Ted needs time to repair. It's tot. Alright, so now we can actually head over into... I don't know why I'm coming back here. Actually, is it going to force me to go to sleep? Well, in any case, there were some things I could interact with before that I didn't really pay much attention to. Like over here, wanted 10,000 gil reward whoever catches him. Does it, like, say who? Can't kill him back there, so I guess the only other option is to leave here. Alright, cool, so we can't leave. Alright, so let's actually head back over to... That tower we saw when we were back in control of Steiner over here. Well, first I need to go down the stairs. But let's be. It'll be all the way over here. And this time the door should be unlocked. Oh. Was that Todd over there? Dr. Todd! Alright, so let's hurry up and catch up to him so we can get that super soft. Princess, thank you for coming. Welcome to my humble abode. This is your home? I traveled quite far in search of a sponsor for my research after I departed Alexandria. I finally found one here in Trino. You have grown into a fine young woman. I am pleased to see you again. Dr. Tot, you look quite well. Ah, uh, Master Steiner, you are escorting the princess? Yes, sir. I deeply regret my earlier actions. Still a straight arrow, aren't you? I'm sure you had your reasons, but I won't ask why. The super soft is in the box right there. Please take it. He's just going to help himself anyway. Don't mind if I do. Received super soft. Have you no manners? Thank the good doctor. It's quite all right, Master Steiner. And I... let me talk to Marcus first. Now I can save my bro. Is there anything in here? I can't believe I must travel with a lowly criminal. You used to be used to it by now. Anyway, let's go ahead and talk... well, is there anything else over here? Okay, so let me take this chance to thoroughly check around here before I continue to talking to Dr. Tot. Make sure there's nothing over here that I can't take with me. Nope. Everything seems all good, so I will continue talking with him. Master Tot, is this Gaia? Yes, it's a globe of our planet Gaia. I remember your lessons. You remember the ramblings of an old fool. Two phrases are commonly found in documents more than 500 years old. One is Jewel, the other is Summoner Tribe. But 500 years ago, the phrases mysteriously vanished from history. The archaeologist Frederick Ash theorized that Jewel refers to dependent passed down to the ruler of Alexandria. 
but the pendant. It is too small to be referring to the same jewel. Other research suggests a relationship between aleodons and magical stones. Dr. Tot! Ah, Princess. Were you reading big books again? <laughs> I've already read every book in this library. But I think, I think better when I'm surrounded by old books. Really? I don't like books. You are a person of dignity. It is imperative that you study hard. I know, I know. Oh, but I was quite taken by that book you gave me. What was it called? It was... Was it I Want to Be Your Canary by Lord Avon? Oh yes, that's the one. So there's a book I like after all. My, my. What's this book, Dr. Tot? That is a globe of Gaia. It's a model of our planet. A Gaia globe? I never knew our castle was shaped like a sphere. <laughs> we live on the surface, princess. Hmm? Ah yes, the stars. They inspired the theories relating to stones and aleodons. That is why... Oh, I'm sorry, I was lost in thought again. It's okay. Where is my room on this globe? Oh, your room is too small to point out on this globe. What about the castle? That I can do. Oh, and Uncle Sid's house? How long has it been? Eight years? Time passes quickly. But I haven't changed. I continue to collect and research these items. Where did you find this globe? It's an antique. It's broken, as you can see, but I use it as an observation deck. Ironically, it's ironic, isn't it? Looking up at the sky from inside a globe. It sure is. Princess, I don't mean to meddle in your affairs, but... I am on your side, now and forever. Please tell me if there's anything I can do. Dr. Tot. I see. So the Queen's forces have already grown quite powerful. Okay then. It may be dangerous, but I shall see to it that you can reach Alexandria. How? I had an old transportation device remodeled in case of such an emergency. This way, please. Ah, we can finally return to Alexandria. I'm coming with you. What? Why? I can reach Blank more easily from Alexandria. Yes, come with us, Marcus. Okay, Steiner. Urgh. Let's go save Blank and restore my mother to her former self. Alright, so I think I have the freedom to go to Alexandria now if I want to. However, I don't want to quite yet. Instead, I am going to do other stuff that I can do right now before I leave. So, this might be the end. Hopefully it doesn't force me to come back. Okay, good, it doesn't. Alright, so we're fine. So yeah, I am going to go ahead and do some last minute stuff in Trino before we leave. Because um, I'm, I'm pretty sure I can't do the oxygen thing anymore, but I can do this key, uh, ATE, Crime and Punishment. So is this back with Cinna before he left? Oh, this is like right when we were probably leaving too. I... I missed it again. How many times have I missed it? It's morning now. But it isn't my fault. It's the South Gate Bunt Cake. Oh my god, he's still there it's because of that? It's so delicious, I just can't stop! When will the next car to Limblum arrive? That sound. That's a car coming back from Alexandria. I'm gonna wait right here this time. What the heck are you doing? I'm waiting for a cable car. So this is where you are wasting time? I wasn't wasting time, I was eating Southgate Bunt Cake. Why are you talking to... Hey, me! 
I knew something was up because Marcus wouldn't give me a straight answer. So this is where you were, ignoring your boss's orders and eating Southgate Bunt Cake. F forgive me, I didn't mean to slack off. It's punishment time. Me? Take my Super Tornado Titanalus Punch. But please, not that, please. No! Take it like a man! Oh my god, okay. Me? Yeah! No! Okay, well, uh, I heavily enjoyed watching that. Anyway, I'm going to come back here and... I want to first try to see if I can do anything inside of the auction house. Whether or not it's going to be over, because I think we can So this is the wrong way. So I want to just go to the auction house, see if I'm able to get anything of importance that I might want for later on. Because I remember like when I was like watching a playthrough from this game like a long time ago, um, someone said something about an important like summoning stone that we can get from here, that we can use later on. I want to see if I'm able to get that, and then I also want to try fighting the monster inside this place sort of right over there. So let me go ahead and check that, see if I can. Today's items are a rare item, Mini Sid, um, Douglas Artifact, Moon's Mirror, and Clan Reflect Ring first. Mini Sid, just starting at. Five. So, can I actually bid in this? I don't really think I want the mini set, so I'll just ignore this one. So, Dogma's Artifact. I think I'll try to get this. Cool, I got that. I think I also want to get this mirror too. Just because I got the money to spend right now anyway. Stop. None of you. You stop it! Like seriously, <laughs> this is too much money. Holy hell, I'm about to let this go <laughs> at this point. One more. Just one more. Don't you dare. Be quiet. Don't say a word. Yep, I'm done. It's, I don't care about this anymore. It's too much money at this point. Okay, the next item. Reflect wing. I, I do want this. Let's go up to 8,000. Come on. Yes. Okay, I got this one too. How much money do I have left now? Oh, that went down quite a lot. Alright, so... I'm done in here for right now. And I'm going to go see if I can fight that creature. Hold on, let me... Let me save first before I go to fight this thing. And it's only letting me do like one person at a time to fight this thing? I can't use my whole party? Let me save, please. Alright. So yeah, actually this is too long. I'm just going to go ahead and say my goodbyes here. And I'll just keep on recording to get that done. And I'll show you guys the results in the next video. So thank you guys for watching this episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy IX. In the next episode... Um, we should be done with everything here in Trino, and we'll be moving on to head back to Alexandra to confront Queen Mom. So, until then, I'll see you guys in the next one. So, take care, everyone.